The funeral is this weekend for a well-known cyclist who died after a car struck him while riding in Pflugerville. The wreck happened at a crosswalk near 10th Street and Settlers Valley Drive. KXAN's Will Dupree spoke to the man's family about their calls for change where this happened. Trin Ho brought flowers to add to the growing memorial that people made for his father, T. Ho. Many neighbors remember the 88-year-old man waving and smiling while he diligently rode his bicycle along the trails. He is out here every day, every single day. Doesn't matter. Meehan Ho says her father kept at it even while going through radiation last year for lung cancer. He rode a bike to HEB, rode a bike to Walmart. They go everywhere. However, she often talked to him about this crosswalk. You always stop before you go. You look around before you, you go because some people they might not stop. Unfortunately, that's what happened early on September 12th. A vehicle struck him in the crosswalk and he died five days later. Yellow signs reading yield to pedestrians with flashing lights are here right now. But the family says these are not enough to keep people safe. The city of Pflugerville told us conversations are happening often about safety for bicyclists and pedestrians, but this crossing is clearly marked. Regardless, Mian wants something more. The point is, I don't want it to happen to anyone in the future. Will Dupree, KXAN News. Pflugerville police told us their investigation has shown that there was inattention on both sides. That's why they have not written a citation or recommended a charge against the driver who struck T. Ho. That person did remain at the scene after the crash to assist police.